Yahya Ibn Alkas, who's the senior representative of the Islamic Forum Europe. IFE, the Islamic Forum Europe, works to further the historic contribution of Islam to European life, including culture, science, education and arts. It encourages individuals to learn and to apply the basic, rule, basic tools required to achieve this within a collective framework, helping to develop the Muslim community and benefit wider society. IFE helped to ensure the Muslim community played a full and active role in voicing their opposition to the massacre in Gaza in January, when we saw the biggest demonstrations for Palestine in British history. Please welcome Yaka. Ladies and gentlemen, friends, colleagues, most importantly, seniors beside me, Ken, George, and of course, our big friend here on the left-hand side. First and foremost, I'd like to say that I'm honored to be in the presence of some of the most honored people here because you, st you sit here because of humanity. You sit here because of justice. You sit here seeking the truth as it should be. And on behalf of Islamic Forum of Europe, I'd like to remind myself and you that we are here tonight on the purpose of serving humanity and Islamic Forum of Europe, whether it be in Tahamlis or anywhere in UK or in Europe and beyond, we will be with you until we see Al-Aqsa and the people of Palestine free. <laughs> resistance is never futile. Resistance may take time, but resistance can never be futile. And let me assure you that we are all part of the resistance every one of you and the little children that you have put here they're the most honored because they have joined the resistance movement they have joined the palestine solidarity campaign they have joined the campaign of justice the campaign of humanity and we are honored to have such little people and we will see those being the people in the future taking the cause of palestine to where it belongs god willing Bringing things back to home, Tower Hamlets, one of the most diverse boroughs in UK. In fact, London, as we know, is an international city. And I'm proud to be a Londoner, I'm proud to be a British, I'm proud to be a Muslim who lives in one of the most multicultural boroughs and works in one of the most multicultural boroughs and the most diverse boroughs in the world. Not just in UK. We have some of the most diverse languages, some of the most diverse tastes, some of the most diverse colours. And in this room, we have all of those colours. They talk about United Colours of Benetton. Well, let me tell you, this is United Colours of Humanity. We at IFE believe in the development of society as a whole. We seek for social and spiritual development of ourselves and our community. And justice is at the forefront of that cause, whether be it for the people of Palestine or even for the people of Jerusalem, for that matter, we will be there because justice does not have any color. We talk about the many that have been killed. I just want to remind myself and you of the thousand, if not more, that have been killed in the recent earthquake in Indonesia. And our solidarity with them is as strong as those around the world. And the Palestine Solidarity Campaign will continue the great work that it has been doing. And I remind myself and you of the importance that it has had in organizing mass demonstrations around the country. In fact, we at IFE, we are very honored to be part of such a great cause. And thank you very much. I just want to finish with this one statement that Brother Malcolm made, Malcolm X, Al-Hajj Malik Al-Shabazz. May God have mercy on him and you know will him. He said, if you don't stand for something, you will fall for anything. And let me tell you tonight, and let me tell you every night, and let me tell myself every night, that you are standing for something, you are standing for justice, you cannot stand for anything better than that. Thank you very much. Yeah.